In this video, I explain comparison between jet condenser and surface condenser. In this image, you see it is the jet condenser and in a jet condenser, the exhaust steam from the turbine and the cooling waters are directly come into contact, means they are mixed with each other. In a surface condenser, means in this image, you see the exhaust steam from the turbine and the cooling water are not directly come into contact means it is called the indirect contact so this red color is the number of tubes and inside the tubes the cooling water is passed and outside the tube exhaust steam is passed okay so means here here means in a surface condenser the exhaust steam from the turbine and the cooling water are not come in a direct contact but in a jet condenser the steam and the cooling waters are come in a direct contact now the second point is condensation of steam is due to heat transfer by mixing of steam with water means in a condenser we know that condensation process is carried out condensation means vapor is converted into the liquid form so in a jet condenser the steam is condensed due to the heat transfer by mixing of steam with water so when the steam is mixed with the water water is absorbed the heat energy from the steam and the steam is start to condense in a surface condenser condensation of steam is due to heat transfer by steam to water through a pipe means <coughs> in a surface condenser the water is passed inside the tubes and outside the steam is there steam is supply heat energy to the pipe and this heat energy of the pipe is absorbed by the water so temperature of the water is increased and steam is condensed third point condensate cannot be used as a boiler feed water until the it is not treated means in a jet condenser we need to do the treatment of condensate and then after they are used in a feed waters in a surface condenser condensate can be directly used as a feed water in a boiler means in a surface condenser we can directly supply condensate to the boiler by using the pump fourth point more suitable for low capacity plant jet condenser is more suitable for a low capacity plant surface condenser is more suitable for high capacity plants in a jet condenser vacuum created is up to 600 mm of hg in a surface condenser vacuum is created is up to 760 mm of hg in a jet condenser maintenance cost is low in a surface condenser maintenance cost is high so why maintenance cost is high because in a surface condenser number of pipe is there so some foilings are there pipe is foils after some time so we need to do the proper cleaning of the pipe that's why its maintenance cost is increased jet condenser is economical and simple surface condenser condensing plant is costly and complicated jet condenser more power is required for a air pump and in a surface condenser less power is required for a air pump so thank you for watching this video if you learn something then like the video and subscribe my channel for watching the more video related to power plant engineering and other subject of this mechanical engineering for power plant engineering various link is provided in descriptions as well as in card for other subject i request to visit the playlist